Hey everyone, I'm here with Jen from Pursuit. They manage the Banff Gondola, which we're inside right now. They also manage the restaurants and the observation deck at the top of Sulphur Mountain. So Jen, uh, how high are we right now? We are about 2,300 meters above sea level, sea level right now. Okay, um, so the town of Banff is kind of behind us. You can see uh, mm -hmm. somewhat uh, the town down there. And also, I want to ask you, how long does it take to get uh, from ground level up to the mountain? Yeah, from the base of the gondola, it's approximately an eight minute gondola ride uh, to the top and there's four observation decks that you can uh, explore while you're up there. And there's two restaurants, um, Sky Bistro, as well as Northern Lights. And uh, we also have a coffee shop up there for you to enjoy. I'm 2,300 feet up in the air atop Sulphur Mountain. I'm at Sky Bistro and I'm here with Chef Claudius Wolf. Uh, he's the chef here and we're about to try one of the dishes. Uh, chef, can you please tell me what we're about to try? So this is one of our most local dishes we have. It's the Eric Bolognese with, with a Canmore, Bucatini, Parmesan, fresh basil and the Uprising Bakery Focaccia. It's actually a perfect example to show what we are doing here. We, we use um, local supplier, local ingredients and put them in a creative way together on a plate. Um, the Bolognese is an Eric Bolognese, so Eric is a very local product we are using. We mix it with beef. 50-50 um, because Alec is a pretty lean, uh, pretty lean cut. So we mix it with beef 50-50 to make it a nice uh, juicy bolognese. We use the pasta from a local company in Camo, which is here basically next door. They produce pasta for us since many years and they deliver an excellent product. So we totally trust in them. This is the Bucatini di Pasta. The pasta comes with a bread, as you can see, a focaccia, which is also from a local company uh, called Uprising Bakery. It is a bakery here in the Bow Valley. I think I'm going tomorrow morning. You totally should. Um, I mean, the products they just do, they are amazing. And they, they do bread and focaccia, especially for us on order. So this is something we ordered from them and they only do for us, which is a great product. Okay, now, how do you get these fine products up here to sky because uh, I don't see a I don't see a, a road up here. How do you get these products up here? This is a, a very interesting question. So we are in a national park. So the only way we can bring stuff up is with the gondola, the same gondola which we use to bring up all the guests and customer. And we have special material carts which we can fill up with uh, goods and groceries up to 500 kilo, but. It is very challenging because we we need to wait until the product arrive, the uh, uh, arrive the supplier. Then we need to fill up those gondola carts and we need to bring them up. This entire team behind this, who's making sure that we have all the products here all the time, and it's quite interesting. Uh, to say the least, there's not going to be a tractor trailer backing up to here, so you can unload it with a forklift. So um, it would be too easy. Okay, so by the way, this is the menu here. And this is the elk, and then I believe we have another dish here. Um, which one is this, Chef? This is our fried chicken and waffle. Um, okay. Typical American dish. Um, we just launched a new menu. This dish was on the old menu, and we um, changed it a little bit slightly on this menu. We have a 62 degree egg, which is basically a slow cooked sous vide egg on the dish just to give in this, this extra kind of texture to it. And I think it's a great advantage and it's, it's worth a try. It comes with maple syrup and as um, maple mustard. So it's totally worth a try. Okay, well, I'm gonna enjoy this dish, of course, with the view behind us. And I'd like to thank you for coming here and uh, doing this interview. This is probably uh, in my top 10 as far as views during dinner, well in this case lunch, so. I'm glad to hear it. Enjoy okay. your day. Okay, alright, thank you.